the energy vibration reading for the Libra Sun Moon and Rising sign for the third week of December 2017 and I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful positive energies um, that you have sent out and it is the third week it is the third week of of uh, January 2018 okay so all right um in this week um it's a positive week for you guys as I look at your week because um we go through the days first this week is beginning from the 15 until the 21st it is the energy vibration of earth week the energy of the heart is balancing out the energy of the hair so as a Friday you um, Friday as a Friday the weekend is going to be good Thursday you can see the beginning of love happening on Monday you have a water energy this water energy that you have on Monday is the energy on Monday um, so it says your angels and guides are asking you to go within and look Look at what you did look at what has transpired they're asking you to go in and look at yourself and be criticize you know criticize yourself look at what transpired whatever the situation whatever is happening in your life at this time go within and look and they are going to show you what you have done or what has transpired and what can be done to rectify whatever is going on okay because there seems to be a situation that is going on Monday is a day of healing it's a very very blue energy the energy of the hermit when the energy of the hermit comes up it wants you to look at yourself and trust me whenever you have the energy of the hermit of the year you know you really see things about yourself that you have never seen before okay on Tuesday you have the energy of um, a hurt energy does is the energy of someone that is going to affect you in positive or negative ways and that is um, someone who is between the ages of 25 and 45 and this is going to be um, a um, Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person okay so um, we are going to see what exactly is going to transpire so as we go forward we're seeing this energy and this is the energy of the ten of swords but it's in reverse okay whatever that has transpired between you and a friend or you and um, your partner whether your husband or your wife um, whatever that has transpired between you and someone else this is going to be um, really really showing up because on Thursday you have the energy of the two of cups okay there has been something that transpired between you and someone else and it doesn't have to be um, your husband or wife or your long-term partner but it, it has to do with someone it can be a friend I'm seeing like is between friends between families whatever has transpired over the Christmas before the Christmas or whatever they want you to take Monday and look within because it's as if you um, you did something that has cost a lot of people and I did say the Prince of hurt but is the Prince of one so this is someone who is and Aries and Leo or Sagittarius okay so the effect that is going to happen on Tuesday as we move forward we are seeing the energy of on Friday uh, the two of Pentacles because you're trying to figure out something about your financial situation on Friday so um, you are going to be trying to balance out your financial situation and you know you're going to go within and ask for help um, from your angels and guides to try and figure out and balance out this thing what is happening on Saturday is positive love is going to come in um, new love is going to come in um, for some of you you're going to be connecting with someone who is an um, Aries a Leo or Sagittarius new love is going to come in for some of you um, this is a good relationship to be in 
um, air and fire is perfect this is wonderful the air and the fire signs are perfect together um, this is good so new love is going to come in for you and this new love on Sunday it is a positive love that is going to come in for you so this week is as if people are going to be um, connecting with each other you're going to be attracting the right people in your life and this is going to be positive okay so let's look forward at your week to see um, what other um, messages there in your week okay um, whatever is happening um, in your week uh, there was a situation that has transpired that um, you were you some of you have stabbed someone in the back some of you have um, relationship out of your relationship and you know things was um, found out so let's see what is happening for you these um, okay all right so there seems to be a lot of situation the Queen of Cups there seems to be a lot of situation that has a transpire okay so let's look at um, your situation something has transpired and whatever has transpired it has to do with your financial situation and you're looking within to see and now you're seeing clearly a situation and what happened because now you're seeing clearly what has and what has transpired what has happened so here you're seeing you know it's as if your angels and guides are letting you go within to see certain situations and certain things that has happened and has transpired um, and if you have a relationship or a friendship with someone who is an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius this could be a woman or a man it will affect you in differently and it has to do with financial situation um, now you're going to see something about this person and this situation that you have never thought about it's as if your angels and guides are pushing you to go within to see um, this situation and, 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 and a lot of people are going to realize oh my god really so whatever it is okay as we look forward we have the energy of the Prince of one because what is going to happen between Tuesday and Wednesday some people is going to have it between Tuesday and Wednesday Tuesday and Wednesday someone who is a fire sign um, try to stab you in the back or have done it but it's not gonna happen because it's as if it, it kind of changes its course it's as if your angels and guides see this coming and it, it kind of changes its course so whoever this person was they came in in your life as a love partner because I'm seeing new love come up but this person did not come as love they came for information somehow this person um, connected himself with you but in false um, permission you know um, as if they they you know they came in as new love but this person came in to, to you know connect with you to know or to receive information about you and they you know they, they stab you in the back for or they try to because it didn't really happen so this is good that it didn't really happen as you know because you have you know something as failure so it's as if whatever was happening because you have the energy of new love and this is this is it you have the energy of new love coming in but yet still there was a situation with someone who is an Aries a Leo or Sagittarius this man he kind of pretend and kind of um, worm itself in your life for some people it hasn't happened for some people it's going to happen in this week but here do not trust this person okay don't trust this person whoever um, this person don't trust them whether it's a, a, um, a man or a woman an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius they're going to be between the ages of 25 and 45 when I say between the ages of 25 and 45 25 and up to 45 okay and they're gonna try and come in as if love no don't do it because the energy of the seven of Pentacles and energy of the seven of Pentacles is like as if um, this person you know is trying to you know push themselves in because they want to know something about you it's not really genuinely 
um, real love okay um, as we go forward and we're looking whatever lies and stuff that was told because this person seems to have told a lot of lies whoever this Aries Leo or Sagittarius person was uh, it's a young person he seems said to told a lot of lies and whatever that has transpired this is a situation with a relationship but ten of swords you have the energy of the ten of swords twice in your reading okay so for some of you it is something that you have done to someone and the ten of swords are so adjacent to each other but they're all in the reverse form which is very good because some of you have you know done things and say things that wasn't true and put an extended because some people think they don't lie but some people just don't say how things is some people cannot um, remember how certain things happen or what was said and whatever that you or someone else tried to do because obviously it is showing that it's the energy that someone um, lied about something or you lied about something this is all over now okay and it has to do with relationship there was a situation with relationship because I'm, I'm coming now to the relationship aspect of your reading because whatever that has transpired for most of you in relationship there was a lot of lies and you yourself wasn't being honest um, some of you were playing the devil's advocate you know and all the lies and things that was conjured up and all the um, oh, lies and things that was conjured up but all uh, you know everybody makes up a story as they go along if even the, it wasn't so they make up a story because they want to give and say something about someone and make something looks as if it wasn't it is all over now it is all over whatever um, for some of you you had a good relationship and you have lost it this relationship you have lost okay some of you have lost this relationship this um, because you have the two of cups and you have the energy of the lovers um, some of you had a very and, and, and some is relationship some some of you had a very very good friend and um, you have lost this person forever because um, whoever this person was they think you play the devil advocate I don't want to have anything to do with you because you weren't honest and honesty and loyalty for this person whoever this person was because some of you it is someone who was your lover some of you is someone who was your partner some of you it was an husband some of you it was a wife so this affects you because it's you based a false sense of relationship with that person and that person is someone that looks up and that, that take people and that open up their lives to people um, that has loyalty loyalty is very very important for whoever this person is that has left you okay so some of you had a friend I'm seeing a lot of women's losing good friends because they weren't loyal enough to this person and the person has totally cut them and blocked them out of their lives and said no I know I you are not someone who um, I would want to be with this is what I'm seeing this is what is transpiring I'm seeing a lot of women you know um, and that's why the energy of the air the airmid comes up for you to look at yourself for you to examine yourself for you to examine yourself to see what exactly you have done and why you have done this because you have ruined something that was very good you have ruined something that would have been very good for you you have ruined a relationship um, that was very good and you're going to say if it was good why did I ruin it 
but what you're not seeing is that is as if this universe send this person in your life for a reason but you were not ready for this person because you were not entering and you did not enter the relationship on a an on an honest and positive note in your life and this person um, came in and realized that um, you are not ready for the eye energy vibration that they have to support you in your life and they have turned your their backs on you and walk away okay and you have the number 10 the number 10 um, is the energy vibration for you guys because the number 10 is one uh, comes out to one okay so it's a new beginning so what this is saying to you what this situation is saying to you because it is someone who you really cared about it is someone who you really um, appreciate having as a friend but it is a situation where you weren't loyal you were playing the devil's advocate and this is the time that it fails you and the energy of the hermit that comes up on Monday is saying to you look at yourself because you have done something that um, let you lose someone who was very good who we sent in your life to help you along your way and they actually because what they're saying is that the energies um, you know this person has just turned their back and just said no no I thought you were ready but you're not ready I have no time to waste I'm moving on and this is in the case of relationship because it was a new love it was someone who came in with pure positive love it was and now this is why you're feeling as if it was a failure because this person came in with pure positive love but you play the devil or the devil advocate and and you know you kind of ruined this relationship because this person is seeing that you are just not ready um, you will you haven't changed your ways um, you have um, you know come back in this lifetime with the same sort of a thing and the person is praying and asking for the Lord of Karma to come in and to end this so that you don't have to do it in lifetime and lifetime again and it's very sad because it was really someone who came in with pure art it's as if this is love this is powerful love this whenever this card comes up this is the universe sending someone who's going to heal you in ways beyond your wildest dream but you played the devil of a card and I don't mean to be down on you because it's not all of you it can be also the other person plays the devil's of a card but why I see that it has to do with you liberance is because the ten of sword is twice in reverse right at the two of cups and uh, um, and the lovers so whatever that you know loyalty is very important in relationships and a lot of people don't see that um, the energy um, for your love uh, section is um, a lot of you will try and see how you can balance out your financial situation a lot of you are going to be trying to figure it out because you ha you're thinking about balancing out how am I going to balance out how do I see this year coming in for me how can I make sure how can I save more how can I you know spend less that sort of a thing that is happening and the, you know with the energy of the seven of Pentacles some of you are working hard on stuff that you're trying to bring in a balance in your life and this is going to be happening with you this is going to be a positive energy that is happening for you okay let's move forward and let's see what is your other energies and I'm gonna get my glasses um, to see this other energies for you guys and you have belonging house of night house of night belonging Oh my god you're reading um, so what is happening is that you people um, need to find and is trying to find a sense of belonging you need to find a place where you belong so it's all about finding that 
place where you belong with the people who you belong with that is what is happening for you in this week as we move forward let's see what is happening here and it's solar power you need to energize yourself you need to find the right energy vibration to vibrate okay so I want to say please like and share these videos and I'll speak to you next week